Hello guys, this is Reese from Bomberito St. Peter's Volkswagen in St. Louis. Today I'm bringing you a 2022 Volkswagen Atlas SELR line, four motion with captain's chairs. This particular one is deep black pearl effect with tight and black leatherette interior. It features keyless entry on all four doors, a power lift gate with the easy open hatch, quad faux exhaust tips on the back there, just below that oversized reflector, LED tail lights, turn signals, and reverse lights on the rear. Incandescent turn signals on the front with LED running lights, LED poor weather lights, and LED uh, running lights there. Uh, the air intakes on the front there, much more aggressive on the R-Line. Splash of piano black and chrome down here. Being that this is a black vehicle, you don't see the difference there, but there's actually two different blacks there. The double hockey stick LED running lights right here to go right into the grill. R-Line badge is right there. It also has dark anthracite 20 inch alloy wheels body color paint below the chrome line down at the base and also at the base of the bumper here chrome window sills right there and the only chrome that's on the back of the car here right below the tail lights and it says atlas right below the volkswagen logo right there sel v6 off to the left and four motion off to the right there seven pin adapter is included with the tow hitch now for 2022 Here's a look at your setup right there. Let's take a look inside. Oh, and there's the R-Line badging right there on the side door panel there. And before we climb in there, there's a look at the quartzite leather or leatherette, leatherette inset right here on the door and also on the arm pad here, right down here. And then you also have this hard plastic right here that's blacked out here. One touch up, one touch down on all four windows. And your power lift gate button is down here below. You have a stainless steel scuff plate right here at the entrance to the door. And then here's a look at your seats. Now these seats are going to be the Titan black leatherette, as I said before. Contrast stitch right here on the bolster, up the side and around the back shoulders here. And into the headrest as well. Memory seats down here as well. Lumbar support is, is power here. And then forward and back. And then up and down is also on this one. And then the seat back adjust is here. And before we climb in here, let's take a look at the seats here. This is the captain's chair setup. So as you can see back there in the back, those headrests, they flick up with the flick of a wrist there. There's a walkthrough panel right or area right here and fold up armrest right here and also right here. There's a light colored headliner here and a power sunroof and a power sunshade there. It's also light colored. I'll go over that in a minute. But as we climb in here, here's a look at that instrument cluster there you have. Uh, a digital cockpit with three different displays there so there is your dial screen your wide screen and then also your crop screen there and you can customize what's displayed there i personally like the wide screen and, and my atlas uh, and then your temperature gauge is here your fuel gauge is over here and as you consume consume fuel these bars disappear here over here automatic headlights poor weather lights are also over here you just pull out on this guy this guy lights up that means your poor, poor weather lights are on. They replaced fog lights, uh, and they also light up your peripheral. Um, then you'd have a coin box for storage here, a telescoping steering wheel, which you can pull out on, push in, raise it, lower it, lock it where you want, and then uh, or set it where you want, and then lock it back. Down, down here, you have an R-Line badge added right here. It's a splash of piano black right there in the base of that. And then down below, down there, you have stainless steel pedal caps. There's my shoes, this is my socks there today. Uh, there's your pedal caps there. The footrest is still uncovered there. It's not uh, It's not uh, stainless steel covered there on this one. But there's the R-Line logo again right here. And on your boot up screen on the radio, you also have the R-Line uh, logo there. Now this car is sold. I do not have it sold, but this was an ordered car and I wanted to make a video of it because I don't have a video of the black one. Uh, so this is all blacked out. Or not all blacked out, but all black. Um, black interior, black exterior, and then the dark wheels. Now, this is probably one of the last ones that we're gonna get of this nature as the SEL R-Line, as they're going to switch to an SEL R-Line Black, just like the SE R-Line Black Edition in the Tiguan. So accents are gonna be blacked out on the car. Here's a look at that mirror. It's an auto dimming home link mirror with the three door garage door memory down here and a Bluetooth button, and then you also your digital compass right there. A vanity mirror with the light above, LED light on each side. Very nice. You have that on both sides there. You have a little storage bin right here and then the speaker up here, there's the sold sign for it. 
Um, now, this radio is AM, FM, and satellite. It also has navigation, and of course it has App Connect, which allows you to do Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, or MirrorLink wirelessly, so the phone can be in your pocket. You also have wireless charging down here on this tray right here. So you can actually charge your phone down here, um, unless you're using a pop socket or something like that, you can charge your phone here in the case. Two USB-C connections here that are also backlit. And then there also, there is a 12 volt charger there. So, uh, you do also have the coin, I'm sorry, uh, the uh, cup holder right here with a light there. And then you do also have, of course, the shifter here. Um, and then uh, push button start. And then also the electronic parking brake. To take that off, you just put your foot on the brake and push down to release. This being a four motion or all wheel drive car, here's the knob for snow mode. Then I can turn it back. There's also my eco, normal, sport, and custom modes. And if I don't want to use the, the screen and get fingerprints all over it like I just did, I can push this button here and change it just by pushing. Then I also have off-road and off-road custom. Off-road custom is going to allow me to tweak different things here. And I'm back to fingerprints here. I can tweak these things here. Uh, and then uh, I can turn it back to the roadway. And now I'm back on eco, normal, sport, or custom. Here's a look at the seats here. They're heated front. The, the front seats are both heated. Storage bin right here. There's a USB-C connection in here as well. You do also have uh, the contrast stitch up here as well. And uh, as, like I said, this is a heated seat. Uh, the contrast stitch goes around the headrest as well as behind the seat here. Let's take a look at the back seat. Oh, uh, the panoramic sunroof. There's a look at it right there. I almost forgot that. We're going to go ahead and open that up there. This pane of glass stacks on top of that one. Pop-up windscreen right there. You've got that right there. Very nice. Let's take a look at the second row seats. Now this one comes in at 40, 49,085. The extras on this one are going to include second row captain's chairs for 695 and also the auto dimming home link mirror for 375. That's all that's on this car. It did not add mats. It didn't add anything else. It kind of expedited getting the car here. So the less stuff you order on it, the better. Here's a look at the captain's chairs. That seat there is leatherette as well as this one here. Fold away armrest right there. As I climb in here, here's a look at the uh, uh, climate control back here. So you have your heat, your heat and cooling right here. Uh, you do also have two USB-Cs here and a 12 volt charger. I'm sorry, a three prong plug in right here. So you can plug in a laptop right there. You do also have a sunshade built in to each of the two rear windows right here and also over there. Car seat hookups are here and here and a fold away armrest right here and you can adjust where it locks in using that dial there. Those seats will fold flat as well. Notice how high they sit off the floor. They fold completely flat. Here's a look at that panoramic sunroof. It covers the front two rows of passengers. Let's take a look at the rear. Here's a look at your dark anthracite wheels and just between the T and the L, we can open this guy up right here and here's a look through from the back to the front. It's a six seater there and these seats will fold flat just by flicking this little guy right here. Steel reinforced plates are in those seats. This is not steel reinforced because this doesn't protect you against anything here in the rear impact, but these seats are and those seats are right there. C-pillar vents right here and also right there. 12 volt charger port there and two more USB-C connections right there for a total of seven. The front plate is right here, the front plate bracket. We put that on on request, just so we get a lot of out-of-state buyers that don't want that. And here's a look through from the back to the front again. Look at that giant panoramic sunroof, the instrument cluster center console right there. And there's your power lift gate. Before I do that, I'm gonna pull up on these seats right here. You just lift up on this guy right here and do it with one hand here. Make sure that little cylinder is down and not red. That tells you the seat is locked. And pull up on this guy right here. Do it with one hand here. There's that red cylinder, make sure it's locked. And the Velcro attaches right there. Top tether on each of these seats and those two seats as well. Just push the button there to close. This car comes with a four year, 50,000 mile bumper to bumper warranty on it from Volkswagen. It's four years, 50,000 miles and includes two years of free maintenance. So your 10 and 20,000 mile oil changes are covered. Also, if you buy from me at Bomberito St. Peter's, we're gonna give you a third year free maintenance as well. That's Bomberito St. Peter's, not the other Bomberito location in St. Louis. There's two Volkswagen dealers. Make sure you come to Bomberito St. Peter's. Also, I'm gonna give you a 10 year, 
200,000 mile nationwide engine and powertrain warranty free of charge. 10 years, 200,000 miles nationwide engine and powertrain warranty. So if you're interested in a car like this one, give me a call. 636-290-4257. 636-290-4257. I'm on Instagram, YouTube, TikTok, and Twitter at Reese Sells Cars. Thanks a lot, guys. Stay safe, stay healthy, have a great day.